Hello everybody, this is Dr. C. Alex Young of NASA's Goddard Space Flight Center and the Sun Today. Well, yet again, the sun has caught me off guard before I had my coffee. But look at this. This is what I woke up to this morning. So here the sun is actually tilted. The image is tilted on its side. But this active region that was coming ar around the limb, just about to rotate out of view, sent off an X7 flare. Okay, this is a really large solar flare. And also associated with it, you can see there's a big wave coming out and this produced a particle event and so one of the cool things about where it is on the sun is the magnetic fields from the sun come out in a spiral and so that spiral uh, curves out and when the magnetic fields are on the edge of the sun on this particular side they curve around and connect with the earth so that means that particles actually who travel along these magnetic field lines because particles are charged and affected by magnetic fields they follow the magnetic fields and so they'll travel around in kind of an arc and connect with the earth so actually I put you up a, a, a diagram here so you can see that one of these magnetic fields comes out of the Sun curves around and hits the earth so that's what we mean when we say well connected event so here, this is just a, this is really cool. This particular active region has been uh, popping off stuff uh, over the past couple of days. So, what a way to go out with a bang! Okay, it just let off this really really nice flare. Looking at uh, images from the Lasco coronagraph on Soho, you can see there's a CME that comes out the side, but you see all the snow on the image. Okay, that's the particles that are impacting the camera on the spacecraft. So all in all, you know, I don't think that we have a lot to worry about here on Earth, but we will see some effects from it. There's the particles will have effects in space. The flare itself can cause disturbances in the upper atmosphere, which can uh, cause some communication delays. And we may see some aurora from all of this. So we don't need to worry here on ground, but this is a really nice event all kinds of really cool stuff going on in it. This is a really great example of, uh, of an interesting space weather event. I also want to add that this is the largest flare of the solar cycle and this was a very nice uh, proton event, one of the largest. So I hope you enjoyed. I'm ending with some more video from STO and I will see you next time.